Frankie D from the Real Radio Show is here with the Barbarian and because of me, because of me, how great is this? It's unbelievable. I am stunned, Frankie. I can't explain what I want to say because I half of my body is numb today. I swear. <laughs> well, the Barbarian doesn't speak, so we have his translate over here. What's he saying? What's he saying? The Barbarian dishes out nothing but pain to his opponents. Oh, but do you tell him that we're 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 friends? We're not foes. He doesn't have friends. The Barbarian is by himself. Okay, tell him that we are radio hosts of the Real Radio Show, and we are honored to be interviewing the Barbarian. Yes. Yes. What do you say? The Barbarian says uh, he likes New York, but is ready to go home. Okay, we gotta make this. He's going to Borneo. Borneo. Okay. okay, we gotta make this really quick because I know he has a match. So, first of all, we are honored that he's here in, in New York. And number two, how does he feel about his competition tonight, his, his uh, competitor? His competitors will face a lot of pain. They will be destroyed. They cannot stand up to the man, to the barbarian. Now, you tell me that he could stop a, a, a chair and, and, a, and a ladder? So if Cousin B went in there, do it. No, no, no ladder. No, no, no ladder? Sense. No. He just he destroys with a boot. That, that's a big. Can we get a camera on that boot? That's a. That is the kick of fear. Oh, that's a big foot. Wow, that's like a size. That's a size 13. 